Nick Pecorero hanging out at Whitney High School on Thursday as the Wildcats take on the sixth ranked Pleasant Grove Eagles. Pleasant Grove would take the first set 25-19, so we're picking this one up late in the second. All tied up at 22, and check out this rally. What a sequence we have here. Jesse Camarillo coming out of nowhere to keep that one alive. And then it's Morgan Kazel's turn, number 11, right there for Whitney. Boom, keeps that one up. She was celebrating her 16th birthday on Thursday. This rally went on so long that we can actually sing to her on this highlight. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Morgan, and the dig goes to you. This rally is still going. Finally, Whitney decides to end this thing as Kazel gets it to Caitlin Cochran, who finds Addie Hamilton for the kill, and everyone is fired up. Whitney ties it up at one set apiece. Then it's Cochran showing off the guns on set point, giving Whitney a 2-1 lead after three. She had a triple-double on Thursday, 12 kills, 22 digs, and 49 assists. But here comes Pleasant Grove in the fourth. Savannah Risley finds Francesca Hahn, who puts it right through the teeth of the Whitney defense. Pleasant Grove takes set four, 25-13. And in the fifth, senior Jade Light takes over for the Eagles. Her name may be Light, but she's a heavy hitter, and she gets that one to go. And then Light puts the finishing touch, showing off her softer side on match point. It's just as effective. The Eagles take the fifth set, 15 to 13. Light went for 25 kills to lead Pleasant Grove to its second win to begin the season.